Hi friends, you are watching for Utech. In today's video, we are going to review the new ROM available for OnePlus 6. It's called as Pixel Experience. This ROM gives us the full Pixel phones experience on your device. So let's get started for the installation and the review of the ROM. Before flashing the ROM, you must be on the Beta Pi ROMs or on the stable Oxygen OS Pi ROMs on your device. Then you have to download these all the files from the link given into our video description. Download all the files, then power off your device and then boot it into the TWRP BlueSpark TWRP is recommended. You must need 9.85 and the above version of TWRP. First you have to wipe your device, factory reset it and then you have to first flash the stock Oxygen OS ROM or any Beta Pi ROM two times on your device. If you are already having the Pi ROM then you have to just flash the stock ROM or the Pi ROM for the single time. Then install the TWRP zip installer then reboot again into the recovery. Now you have to wipe your phone. After the wiping your phone you have to now flash the pixel experience ROM zip file. Here the ROM comes with the pre-installed pixel G apps. So you don't need to flash any G apps after flashing this ROM. Wait for a while. After the completion of installation, you have to flash the TWRP, BlueSpark TWRP zip again, flash the TWRP and then again reboot your phone into the TWRP. If you want to root your phone, then you have to flash the Magix, any version uh, or you can flash the 17.1 is the stable version available for now. Now click on the reboot button. Now you will see there is a gorgeous logo, boot logo for uh, this ROM. This ROM looks very pretty and awesome. After the completion of boot, you have to complete the initial setup for your device. After the completion of full setup, you will see that on the home screen you will get the pixel launcher uh, looking very awesome and it has a very nice wallpaper see this it looks very nice uh, and uh, when you go under the settings and about phone you will see that the security patch is for the 5th october it's the latest and you get the android 9.0 pyrom when you boot for the first time you will see that there is a normal navigation bar available for this rom you have to Go to the settings and go to the gestures to avail the new Google Pixel navigation peel bar. So here you will get that option. Enable the swipe up on the home button. After enabling this option, you will see that there is a small peel at the bottom. You can switch between the different apps easily. As this is the Pixel Experience ROM. You get the stock pixel launcher along with this ROM. See this, this is the pixel launcher. You get the all the goodies uh, like the left swipe for the Google feed. You get the notification dots. You also get the stock recents uh, which comes with the pixel phones. See this, this is the notification dots and they, and they are working very good. There is no problem. All the things are flawless. Under the home settings, you get the different uh, options to customize your pixel launcher. So it's very convenient. Uh, here the all the things are working with this ROM. Night light is an option also available with this uh, ROM. Everything is working flawlessly. Your Wi-Fi, your Bluetooth, the NFC your auto rotation uh, flashlight all the things are working good there is a um, uh, dual 4g option is also available under the network option i have personally tested this and they are working good there is no problem 
Vice Royalty is also working flawlessly. There is nothing uh, regarding this. There is um, your fingerprint is also working good with this ROM. You can able to easily uh, set this uh, pixel fingerprint. So the ROM is as it's a 9.0 Android Pie ROM. You get the all the features like the new volume slider. You can easily access the uh, sound control option. Notch is also working. All the notifications uh, will be shown into your status bar. There is no problem yeah, against uh, a notch. Here you get the rotation icon in your navigation bar. When you uh, keep your phone into the landscape mode, it will show automatically. So it's very convenient. You also get the new uh, swipe up for the home or for the recent menu. In from the in recent menu, you can uh, copy any paste or any image and can paste it in any app. That is very convenient. You get the split screen option. You can easily use the two apps in a uh, split screen supported applications. So it's also very good. Uh, all things are working. Clear all button is also available in the recent menu. Now we will see that uh, some customizations option available in the settings. The ROM comes with the digital well-being which is the uh, stock application of pixel phones which is also available with this rom so this rom is uh, totally as a stock rom available for the pixel phones under the display you get the uh, color mode option you get the font size you can also able to change the display size here the ambient display option is also available and here you can able to enable the always on ambient display feature. The ROM comes with the device theme option but there is a bug that the dark mode is not working properly in this ROM and it will get fixed into the next update. The next bug in this ROM is that the alert slider is also not working and this bug is also get uh, will be fixed into the next update uh, the, all the things are good with the some bugs here and there but it's a daily usable ROM you can able to access your stock camera by double clicking your power button the stock camera comes with this ROM is a simple one it doesn't gives you lots of features but the, all the things are working 4k ultra hd video recording and the front cam 180p video recording is working the camera clarity is very good you can see these samples and these samples shows that the camera having the good picture quality the images are sharper and clearer as compared to your stock camera if you want uh, another camera the link of that uh, snap uh, sorry pixel camera is given into our video description you can able to download that apk and install it this camera gives you lots of uh, features like the panorama mode it gives the uh, uh, portrait mode portrait mode is working the cam clarity is also very good and it also gives you lots of feature like the photo booth but uh, sadly this some extra features are not working like the night light uh, photo booth these features are not working so it is uh, this is the sample of camera and it's looking very good the pictures are sharper and clearer as compared to your stock camera the some extra features like the photo booth and the night light is not working but the google lens slow motion slow motion is also not working in video recording but the google lens photosphere these options are working uh, the portrait mode is also working good uh, in this camera and the motion photos are also working see this this is the night uh, night light sample the slow motion will show you the moving images uh, for your pictures 
say this uh, this is the motion photo you can able to disable and enable while uh, watching that photo in the photo application google photo app so this rom is the very fast and fluid the uh, all the applications are running smoothly as i am using it this rom from the one day there is no lag uh, performance is very good battery performance of this rom is also very good you will get the full day battery with the 6 hour of sot so guys like this video subscribe our channel and press bell icon